Hi, welcome to my channel. Today I want to talk about what we can do to keep America great. Because I believe that Donald Trump, although he's great and all, he's just one man and he can only do so much. So yes, I believe that Donald Trump will win this election, but I don't think that's where the battle ends. I think it'll only be the beginning. So I think once he wins, what we need to do is start grooming the next president, start grooming the next congressman, start grooming the next senators, councilmen, governor, mayors, all the way down to school and superintendent. And not only that, you know, it's at this time where I think once he wins the election, I don't think Black Lives Matter will go away like they always has. And I hope that I'm not scaring people. I don't want this to be, um, I want you guys to get scared over this video, but I'm just telling you my thoughts, especially with seeing how our children have been indoctrinated in school you know, a lot of times things come up in the election year, like uh, Black Lives Matter rear, rear their ugly heads. But you got to think that with all these people on board, they have been uh, programmed for years. They've been programmed. So actually, you know, the Marxists, they've been working towards this for years. So... In order for us to fight for our freedom of speech, for our gun rights, for our freedom of ownership, in other words, capitalism, we all need to be at work. We need all hands on deck. And whatever facet for you that look like, you know, we need you in whatever capacity that may be. Everybody is not cut out to do the same thing. Everybody is not able to do the same thing, which is good because we need people to do all sorts of different things so that we can turn this runaway train around. Now, I was just thinking that, you know, just to give you some ideas of some of the things you may do, but the, the list goes on and on. I just wrote down a few things that, you know, you may want to work with a campaign. If you can protest, anytime you can protest something. Um, if you know something, if you are, you know something that shouldn't be a whistleblower. And if you don't know about um, Veritas, please look that up. Um... And I think I'm forgetting, oh, Project Veritas. Please look that up because they are whistleblowers. And the guy said that uh, he used to be a reporter, but he left that profession because, you know, um, as I spoke in my last uh, video, they're not legit anymore. So he liked investigative reporting and he liked exposing um, things, bringing things to the light. He liked to expose the truth and what's going on. So um, he started Project Veritas and it's very successful. So, you know, if there's something that you know that you want to blow the whistle on, uh, contact Project Veritas and they will allow you to stay um, anonymous, you know. So um, boycotting, donating, and also, you may be a person that's home. I have a, a subscriber. Her name is Cat Lady. And hi, Cat Lady. And she said, oh, I wish I could go out and do things like you, but I just can't get out like that. It's okay. You can still play a part. Somebody like you can still play a part, even though you can't get out. You can uh, help me and other people that you watch on YouTube time you start watching that video like that video anytime you can comment comment anytime you can share 
share if you're bold enough. I know some people uh, don't like to share because they don't want to get the uh, fallback, you know, the backlash and everything. I understand that. But if you're bold enough and you're in a position to do it, share the video so that this information gets out. Um, and most importantly, pray. You know, and that's something we can all do, us believers, those that believe. that, And it's powerful. Even though it's, it might be the last thing um, you may think of, but it's the most that you can do. So, also I was listening to... Um, Prager you today a video and you guys may want to check it out the video came out today and it's called American students deserve a better education and they mentioned that they have um, started this thing called prep and prep is for parents that are trying to um, trying to work with the schools or trying to change what they're children are learning in school or trying to see just what they can do to combat that and so that's another thing you can do talk to your children if they haven't gone too far off the rails especially if they're young if they're young talk to your children about patriotism talk to your children about american history you teach them at home because a lot of times what they're taught at home they believe, just like the Democrats that was taught by their parents to vote Democrats, it's hard for them to let go of that. So if you teach them patriotism and you teach them American history, you know, the good, bad, and the ugly, and just let them know, you know, that, hey, this is our history, but we have come so far. You know, we worked through a lot of things. Yes, we got a ways to go. Everything isn't perfect. You know, probably will never be perfect, but we come a long ways. And, you know, you can give them examples and things. Um, also, what I, you know, I don't have any small children, but what I would do too is while you have your children in the car, listen to some of our videos. Let them hear what some of these conservatives are saying, especially if they're young and they're not at that age where they already been programmed and it's hard to turn back um you know you have a captive audience but talk to your children there are so many things you can do um and as i mentioned before donate if you're somebody that has the money to donate you just don't have the time you know donate Donate to, you know, find a cause, you know, that you believe in, you know, if God lays it on your heart and donate. And speaking of donate, I need somebody to help me. I'm trying to design some t-shirts and uh, I'm trying to use Teesprings because I know they will allow me to use that in conjunction with YouTube. But I've been having trouble designing. I know a little bit about technology Enough to be dangerous, but not enough to really do something. So if you're willing just to volunteer a little of your time and help me, I would appreciate that. And we can work out some things behind the scenes. But um, if you're willing to do that for me, uh, you can reach me at firsteris at gmail.com. And I will put my email in the description uh, place below. So... Um, I would appreciate that. And please don't send me all kind of emails. Just if you're interesting, interested in helping me or if you really need something from me, um, then you can um, send me uh, an email. But other than that, just keep everything in comments. And, you know, guys, I respond to every comment, even if I just give you a heart. So that's all for this video. I thank you for watching this. If you watched it to the end, thank you so much. Please make sure you like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. To like and subscribe, it takes less than one second and it's free. So you guys, you know, this is just another way of supporting the conservatives out here. It's free to do it. 
it boosts our channels so that um, we will be noticed. And it's something that you can do um, on every video. It's a way to support. Thank you again for watching this video and have a blessed day. Bye.